that winter storm warning for all of Vermont and New Hampshire and most of northern New York starts at 8 o'clock this morning, goes until 1 o'clock tonight. It may be quiet this morning, but we have a lot of snow on the way, and that's why the National Weather Service has issued that. A couple of little flurries already starting to make an appearance as clouds fell out this morning quickly. The bulk of the snow, though, is over western Pennsylvania, Ohio, Great Lakes, and that is headed in our direction, as you can see quickly making its approach. This whole system is going to drop a lot of snow on us, but it's also going to exit and uh, exit pretty quickly later tonight. We do eventually dry up before I get into amounts of snow that'll add up. I do want to remind you guys that if you are out early this morning, it's pretty chilly out there. Most of us in Western Vermont are right near 10 degrees, including Middlebury, Burlington, and then into Plattsburgh as well. But we do have some single digits in Eastern Vermont and parts of Northern New York for the afternoon. It warms up pretty good. It's still going to be below average, but we won't be nearly as cold as it was this morning. 21 by noontime highs near 23 with a slight breeze, but not much. Of course, that snow is the bigger story. 8 o'clock scattered snow showers, especially the further west that you are, and then that'll fill out. And by lunchtime, we're looking at widespread and steady snow for pretty much everyone. And that will continue all the way through the time you're headed home from work. And that is the major problem out of this system is that we're going to have a have really me a really big mess on our hands by the time you're driving back around three or rather around four or five o'clock. We're already looking at three to six inches of snow already on the ground. And then a little bit more falling as the evening progresses later tonight. Low visibility with that heavy snow falling up to an inch per hour in some places and of course slick roads. But the good news is that we should find improvement as we're able to catch up on some of that road clearing by tomorrow morning because the system gets out of our hair pretty fast later tonight. But by the end of the day, four to eight inches of snow are possible in the Champlain Valley and for most of northern New York. I would count on Burlington being on the higher end of that scale and then likely above eight inches, maybe even close to a foot of snow in some places for most of the rest of Vermont and the Adirondacks. So again, a lot of snow on the way this afternoon. Here it is again towards lunchtime, really filling out steady, heavy snow all the way through commute time home and then a couple more inches on top of that later this evening. It's moving out pretty fast tomorrow. Some sunshine looking like a pretty nice Thursday, even though it's going to be a little bit chilly out. And then we've got a couple more of those snow showers moving in Friday night through Saturday morning, but that's mostly light. Another more potent system on Sunday going to bring a warm up, but also the potential for some rain mixing with snow as we finish out the weekend and then we'll dry up for the start of next week.